Hello there, my name is Randil. Welcome back to our channel, English with Sanjana. In today's video, I am going to help you with geography. Lesson 5, Unit 1, the Asian region. The main objective of today's chapter is to study population distribution in Asia. In my previous video, I already discussed important information on ancient human civilization and types of human races in the Asian region. If you haven't watched my previous video on the Asian region, it is advisable to watch that video first. Then you may feel quite confident to watch this video. First, we will be looking at present population in the Asian region. Next, you can have a general idea about the unequal population distribution in the Asian region and some physical factors that have impacted this unequal population distribution. Then we will move on to learn about some regions in Asia in terms of population density. Some regions in Asia are highly and densely populated whereas some areas are sparsely populated. As the final content in this presentation, you will be reminded of 10 countries with a higher density of population and 10 countries with a lower density of population. I have already included lots of colorful and relevant pictures and maps for your quick and easy understanding. If you stay tuned until the end of this presentation, I am pretty sure you can have a better understanding on the population distribution in the Asian region. Then join me in this lesson on the Asian region and its population. If you are ready, let's begin. The Asian region, population distribution, unit 1, lesson 5. In my previous videos on the Asian region, we already discussed much information on the geographical location of Asia, physical landscape of Asia and human landscape of Asia. On the human landscape of Asia, we already learned about ancient human civilizations and types of human races in Asia. In this video, we will have a sharp and quick focus on population distribution in Asia. Population distribution is a critical phenomenon which can be used to determine whether any region in the world has reached its own limitations in terms of population and its distribution. Population distribution means how humans have spread geographically on the surface of the earth. The present population in Asia is more than 4.46 billion. Out of this, more than half is distributed in China and India. This population is unevenly distributed among Asian countries. There are many factors that have contributed for the unequal distribution of population. These factors can be divided into two categories. They are physical factors and human factors. In this presentation on population distribution in Asia, we are not going to pay our attention to human factors. We will only be looking at physical factors. What are the physical factors that have impacted this unequal distribution of population in Asia? They are relief features, climate, drainage and soil. In addition to these, distribution of natural resources and natural vegetation are also factors that affect population distribution. So, population varies from region to region. Physical factors have mainly impacted this unequal distribution of population in the Asian region. Now, let's look at the regions in Asia in terms of the density of population. Some regions are highly populated, whereas some regions are sparsely populated. When considering the population in Asia, based on the density of population. A higher density of population can be found close to 
river valleys in South Asian countries, South East Asian countries and East Asian countries. Indo-Gangetic plain in North India is an example for a river valley in South Asia which holds a higher density of population. Irrawaddy River Valley in Myanmar is such example for a river valley in Southeast Asia which is home for a higher density of population. Huang Ho River Valley in China is too a significant example for a river valley in East Asia which shelters a higher density of population. These areas are very special examples for river valleys with a higher density of population in Asia. Not only that, some areas can be cited in Asia with a lower density of population. A sparsely populated region in Asia are Central Asia, Mongolia, Northern Flatlands, Gobi Desert, Thar Desert. Now it's time to remind you of 10 countries with a higher density of population by 2017 in Asia. Population in China. It was 1,370 million. Population in India. It was 1,299 million. Population in Indonesia. It was 255 million. Population in Pakistan. It was 192 million. Population in Bangladesh. It was 159 million. Population in Japan. It was 127 million. Population in Philippines. It was 103 million. Population in Vietnam. It was 92 million. Population in Iran. It was 79 million. Population in Turkey. It was 78 million. Now, we pay our attention to 10 countries with a lower density of population by 2017 in Asia. Population in Maldives. It was 345,000. Population in Brunei. It was 421,000. Population in Macau. It was 641,000. Population in Bhutan. It was 760,000. Population in Timor. 1.24 million. Population in Bahrain. It was 1.78 million. Population in Qatar. It was 2.11 million. Population in Armenia. It was 3 million. Population in Mongolia. It was 3.02 million. Population in Georgia. It was 3.73 million. This is the end of our presentation on population distribution. With this presentation, we conclude human landscape in the Asian region. Thank you very much for watching. That is really wonderful of you to watch this video all the way to the end. We hope you understood the lesson and enjoyed the video. If you find this video useful and interesting, subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell. Don't forget to share this video. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Bye now.